Alicia Buari deactivates Twitter account in solidarity with husband. In what appeared as solidarity with her husband's administration, Aisha, who joined Twitter in February 2016 and has over 1 million followers, on Friday said she was deleting her account. Aisha Buari, the wife of President Muhammad Buari, has announced the deactivation of her Twitter account following the ban of the microblogging site by the Nigerian government. Nigeria's Formation and uh, Culture Minister La Mohammed had announced Twitter's suspension in a statement by his media aide, Shegu Adeyemi, on Friday. The suspension by the Nigerian government comes days after a post by the President Buhari on the 1967 civil war was deleted by the microblogging platform. The suspension of the social networking service was also shared on the Twitter handle of the Federal Ministry of Information, which has announced sorry, which has since generated reactions from some Nigerians on Twitter. The Nigerian government spokesman cited the persistent use of the platform for activities capable of undermining Nigerians' uh, corporate existence as the reason for the suspension. In what appeared as solidarity with her husband's administration, Aisha, who joined Twitter in February 2016 and has over 1 million followers on Friday, said she was deleting her account. I will be deactivating my Twitter account for now. Long live the, sorry, long live the Federal Republic of Nigeria, she tweeted. The Nigerian First Lady had gone off the uh, radar around September 2020 shortly after the flamboyant wedding of her daughter, Hannah, and then uh, her groom, Mohammed. Apart from the luxury on display, event planners for the wedding were flown in from the United Arab Emirates to add color and spice to the ceremony. Earlier in August 2020, the First Lady was also reported to have flown to Dubai in a private jet owned by a billionaire uh, Mohammed uh, under the guise of going for a medical emergency but to stop for luxury items ahead of the wedding. Most of the times, including uh, souvenirs used for the wedding, were bought in from the foreign country. A top source had told Tara reporters in December 2020 that the first lady had now relocated quietly to the United Arab and that she would not be returning anytime soon. Aisha Buhari has re relocated gen quietly to Dubai. She had been going uh, even before the daughter's wedding. For three months now, she had been there. Before the wedding, she also stayed for months during lockdown, shopping and relaxing. She was initially planned to be sick, but since the end of the wedding, she has been away. And then, Zahara had a baby. Aisha has been away since. Occasionally, she issued statements announcing the distribution of palliatives she cited insecurity in the villa after that shooting incident, a presidency source had stated. <laughs> you that belongs to the kitchen, you are supposed to even have a Twitter account. Nigerians are reacting. Are they, so they are thinking that ban of Twitter will stop the company from flourishing. This is just Fulani mentality. All right, dead or living husband. So she is in solidarity with what a imagined husband is doing to Nigerians, not only as a supposed wife, but as a mother. Please, is she the wife of the former or the recent young man? Someone is asking. Life more in Dubai. I don't blame you, Mrs. 
Dubai, you think Twitter is IPOP. Proudly, Niger, I have also deactivated my Twitter account in solidarity. All right, someone said, who cares? Boko Haram in government. Aisha, who are you? Your solidarity is just nonsense. All right, someone said, thank you, Twitter. Evil shall be regarded as evil, no matter who committed it. They thought it's country where they cover evils from the government. Yes, Aisha, you are very right. That is what all reasonable Nigerians who are patriotic should also do. Organizations should be allowed to, to rise above us by opposing the right of our sitting president to make a statement. If we have any integrity, we should each personally reject this political situation. Notwithstanding rubbish to Twitter and Facebook, they should go to hell. All right, someone said very soon you will also deactivate your lives by grace God, by the grace of God. Please deactivate your bank account to make we know. Just look look at the way they are using this country to play ball. God will judge every one of you. Let them go to hell. Who cares? If you wish, delete all your social media handles. Criminals and terrorists and power. God will judge you all. Nigerians are still reacting. For information, you and your Twitter account are the least of our concern. How have you helped with your miserable Twitter account, Madame Buhari? Though you will maintain your posture to the end, but it's clear you have been concord to blend. But listen, time, but listen, time will come when all of you will regret the treatment you have uh, given to Nigerians, he said. So guys, you've all heard it now. Aisha Buari have announced of deactivating her Twitter account, you know, as a solidarity with her husband administration. I'm dropping it here for now. Hit the comment section and don't forget to give us thumbs up. Thank you very much for stopping by. Bye. -bye.